Hello and welcome to Lucius Create. Today I want to show you a lock and key method that's been used for over 6,000 years. First created by the Egyptians and made out of wood. Uh, it's a, a gravity fed model so it would work well on a door or something that you didn't have to worry about flipping upside down. So you can see here this is the thing we're trying to open. You can see it wiggling back and forth. Uh, there's actually a fourth pin back here and the pin is up. And when you pull this lever, the pin goes down, which allows this whole thing to slide out. But in order to do that, there's three pins here. And these three pins are down. So we have to put this key in, like so. And then when we lift up on the key, it's going to take those pins and allow me to slide that lever. See this lever down here? allows me to slide it open, which takes that fourth pin and drops it. And once I do that, this thing opens up. So you see, here's the fourth pin. And then you can see there's the a yellow pin here, here, and a brown pin in the middle. And I'll just show you. So I'll lock it up. See how this pin goes up. And then I can pull the key out. Let's see how it locks everything up. So you can see these pins slide up and down. So when you put the key in and you see the key has teeth that matches up with those pins. So it's able to push the pins up. There's a great example of this uh, on a channel called Newton Makes, and he makes it out of wood, very small, uh, even smaller than this, actually. And he has a little piece of plexiglass on the front, so you can really see you know, what's going on when you put the key in and lift the key up. So see how I lift the key up and it lifts those pins up, and then my finger here pulls this back and you can see that falls down and all that is in there is just a, a roof piece and when I pull the roof when I it's on the end of this here and when I pull it pull it back the roof piece slides back which makes this fall down and in here there's just some pieces going across uh, you know right here inside there so that the, this isn't going to slide until this falls down. So I'll show you here. Key in, it up, slide that. So you can see when I slide that down, then this will slide over that piece. But then when I lock it, it goes up above, and it won't slide because it catches. So that's it. It's uh, like I said, it's a little tricky. Uh, designing it so that the teeth line up with these pins and then um, and then you have to then figure out a way to make it work you know in this case with a, a lockbox uh, but yeah a fun build it, it didn't take too long to build uh, it was nice having the the Newton makes box in front of me uh, so that I could watch how he did it and it was helpful because, it, the, you know, there are quite a few little pieces inside. So I'll, uh, I'll take this guy apart so we can take a peek in and see how it works here. Get the lid off here. see these pins are an interesting design you can see yeah, I'll take this front panel off I 
take it all off. Oh, yeah, it will. Alright, hopefully this will give you a really good idea of what it looks like. Do these pins just sit here? Like this. And you can see uh, the white that you see in the front here is this guy. So if I were to remove the pins, you can see that white slides back and forth. But as soon as I put a pin in here, it stops it. And the three pins is just uh, because three is better than two and two is better than one. So once you get those pins in, nothing you can do. Now you can see in there, you can slide this key in. And then by lifting the key, it lifts those pins up. So the first thing I made for it is this guy and this is the slider and you can see it fits in there nicely and it goes back and forth see that nice and easy and what happens is is this guy sits here and when it slides the pin goes down and then when it slides back the pin goes back up so once i had that done I made these three pieces here, and these sit in here, like that. You can see they block the slider so that it can't slide. So the only way it's going to slide is if these three pieces get moved. And once they're moved up, it slides. So then, I'm just going to put a piece to keep that slider from coming out. There we go. So then I made this key. The key is pretty simple. The key slides in. And you can see it's got three built-up spots which match these pins so that when you put the key in and lift it up it lifts those pins which allows the slider to slide so once that's done I was able to build this box that just sits around the end of the slider. I'm gonna put this guy in there and see the slider go up and up and down. It's a little complicated, uh, but it is a nice lock. It's it's uh, it's neat to be able to put together something that you know has been around for for so many thousands of years. That's it. Thanks for watching. Please uh, subscribe to my channel so you can see other uh, stuff I'm doing. And uh, yeah, thanks. Thanks for watching. <laughs>